Yes, so you talk about space and earth politics, which I think is a wonderful way to explain things. But how much of an effect has global politics had when it comes to space collaboration? You were just talking about it there, but it seems like Russia is becoming increasingly marginalised. And what does their space programme look like now from when we remember it back uh, almost 20 years ago? And do they still have finances on their side? Un until the Ukrainian war started, um, it was very much a question about collaboration uh, on both sides. Uh, every, it, was, it was almost like space was a bit immune. Uh, part of that was because space is scientific, it's the common quest for humankind, but it did seem like the Earth politics couldn't reach uh, the, the outer space. Um, however, um, there was also another argument, uh, argument in, 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 uh, a reason for that, and that's, that's because for a period of time, the Americans did not have access to space, to the International Space Station. Uh, they simply did not have, after the uh, space shuttle was retired, access to, uh, to go to space, to go to orbit. So they had to rely exclusively on the Soyuz rocket. So there was also a bit of necessity towards the end of it. But after the Ukrainian war, things changed. Yeah, Russia went a lot more independent. Uh, China has got their own space station up there today and doing doing their thing. Um, so there has been a little bit of a breakup in, in terms of this uh, collaboration, although occasionally um, the agencies do get together. So, for instance, when Shang'e 4, the Chinese mission, uh, landed on the dark side of the moon, they could not have done that amazing feat if it wasn't with a bit of help from NASA, with a bit of help from the Europeans uh, as well, and Russians as well. It was actually a, a nice collaboration, even though it was less advertised. Uh, it was more present, presented as a Chinese, uh, a Chinese uh, victory. Um, but it certainly was co collaboration. So there is in the scientific community uh, a desire to stay away from uh, politics as much as possible, but obviously um, it, it does affect. In terms of the budget on the Russian side, yes, I mean, a lot of that is going to the war machine at the moment. So clearly resources are being directed and, and it's perhaps less important to be seen as a space conqueror um, just for the pride and prestige. But when it comes to the military side of things, uh, beyond a no illusion, there is a lot of dollars being invested also on the Russian side in terms of uh, military capabilities from space.